All right, let's immerse ourselves for real this time. Um, that that last attempt at getting started didn't count because it's stuff. So I've made a decision. I'm gonna use my wheel for this career. My G27 is control listed as driving force in the controls. So so uh, yeah, that's the thing we're gonna do. But let's do the final thing in this game. And that is the extreme difficulty career mode. Yeah, yeah. Let's let's fucking do this for real this time. So, whoops. Double input. Didn't mean to do that. So we're gonna be uh, donkey lopsided here. Out out, difficult lopsar. So. Uh, again, the goal to this is to drive cars that I didn't drive in the first career mode. So since we went with Noble uh, first time, we're going to drive the Audi this time. Yeah. Best team on the racing circuit, Andrew Hyatt says. We'll see about that. But uh, anyways, let's just get going. For real this time. First round at Silverstone. Let's go. Full year after this game, damn. <laughs> yeah, uh, I'm using a wheel that is uh, quite a lot uh, younger than this game. My neck would stop itching, that'd be cool. So, here we go. This is going to be my first like actual drive with the wheel. I did a little test drive to get it to actually work, but... Uh, this will be our first actual drive at the wheel. Um, 25 lap race, by the way. Uh, the extreme. We're, we're going to the extreme here. Oh, we're going off the track. All right. Oh, this is going to be weird with no force feedback, but it's also going to be a lot quieter. And, like, deadly to my wheel. So, we'll, we'll take it. I'll take the lack of feedback. It's fine. I thought, you know, gotta properly, like, immerse myself with this career. So, the only way to do that is to uh, plug in a steering wheel. Old school NASCAR pro style, yeah. It's going to take some getting used to, I know that. Dude, this car's ridiculous. Welcome to DTM. <laughs> From like 2000. Ooh! Yep, fucked it. Talking about the DTM TT is great. All right, so we're pro definitely starting last as I try to come to grips with playing this game with a wheel. This is going to be interesting. Sounds like a skill issue. Rear end lift at high speeds. Alright, yeah, this lap sucked. I think it's still gonna be a sub two minute, but just barely. Okay, no, it's not. Never mind. Your driving shows promise. Keep practicing, Damn. and you're sure to finish on top. Well, two minute point four six, that's definitely last. Yeah, definitely last. Although the times don't look any different than the uh, the other career. But yeah, I think uh, the AI difficulty seems to be pretty much the same. The, however, the race length definitely is not. <laughs> so, we got 25 laps, which since we're in the GT class, that would probably amount to about 20 laps with the prototypes lapping us, but 
Uh, here we go. First race of the uh, the extreme career. Starting last. Go. We got we got about 20 laps here. Let's go. Oh, we also have a fuel meter, by the way. Um, that's 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 a thing exclusive to the uh, extreme career. So, uh, yeah. Cars is about your Torino. Ooh, big slide, big slide. I remember sliding the cars is like the name of the game here. It's still very on brand. I right, passed my teammate. Oh. Small crunch to get past the uh, the noble. So let's see if I have anything for the Quaif and the BMWs. So far, the answer is yes, but also they're pretty slow at Silverstone compared to other tracks. Nineteen fifty. Gonna, yes. Yes, I'm gonna quaff on the BMWs. Exactly what I said. Wait, so it was a wheel mounted typewriter drive? <laughs> yeah, random DTM car in the middle of a GT race. They're on top here. First lap, 57-1. Oh. Not a bad first lap. Better than my actual qualifying lap. BMW bad run through cops. Because he got quaffed on. Oh shit. Come on, come on. Take second in class. I've taken second in class. Let's go. Quality fade. It's not how you spell it. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a classic upshift and immediately lose speed because I fucking drove into the gravel. Alright. I'm starting to sort of get used to the wheel. Um, except when the car like super understeers at times. Not used to that. Anyways, like I said last attempt when trying to get the wheel to work. Uh, yeah, this game's going to stick around a lot longer than uh, than I thought it was going to. I'm working on it. Working on the overtake and you'll take the lead takeover. Go, go, go. I can hear the quaff behind me. Alright, two laps down. Still say it's going to be about a 20 lap race for us. Oof. Buki. These physics on a wheel feel weird, but like I've also I've also driven a game that has weird physics on a wheel before. Remember Corvette? I'm reaction playing through that game with a wheel. <laughs> because reasons. That makes you the leader. 
Hell yeah, we've taken the class lead. Let's go. Yeah, played through Corvette with a wheel. It works surprisingly well. P. Clown leading the race. Our first extreme race. Oh, oh, oh Dix. Oh, Dix, oh, Dix, oh, Dix. We're good. The DS version of Corvette. I'll fucking do it. Don't tempt me. I will find... I'll find a complete inbox copy right now on eBay. Oh, this is a strong lap. 54-6. Nice. Those Twitch threads are weird like that. It always tags the OP. No one else. Three down. Oh, this car be sipping fuel, apparently, because uh, the meter has not moved at all. The needle has not moved at all. Catching up to the uh, the GTS Panoses. It's not looking likely. But hey, it's it, the meter's there. I guess. I'm seven seconds ahead of Blackwood. Damn. I have a feeling these races aren't going to be ex very exciting. <laughs> but we're still going to fucking do them. I am going to complete this damn game. Art. This is the real first clean diesel Audi. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Fucking it. Fucking it. I'm unfucked. Alright, see if I can find the button. That's the camera change button. Trying to find the, uh... Oh, that's, 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 that's not it. Trying to find the, uh, the emotions button. Found it. Found the emotions button. Let's see how these drivers are feeling. Also, damn. Bentley is fucked off in the lead. Some panos. I hear, uh, I hear prototypes behind me. I see a prototype behind me. There, right, we got the panos in second. We got the uh, GTS panos sliding everywhere. Oh, yep, yep. Hi. Oh, he's already mad. 
Oh, what is happening? Pano's on Pano's violence here. This is cutting them off in the grass. Holy shit. Multi-class racing. Oh, hi. Hello, angry Panos. He's pissed. Not only did he just get bullied by it, his stable mate in a different class, but... He's lost an overall spot to a GT car. The lower class car. There goes the dome. Oh, there goes me and the BMW prototype. Oh, Jesus Christ. Panos. Okay. Well, that was a wacky first ex uh, exchange with the prototypes. So, um, shit. Passing the, the, the GTS back marker. Dicks, dicks, dicks. Screw diesel. Something, something, Kevin Nash. Terrible lap. Meanwhile, I have a nine second lead in class. Six laps down. to go. That happened. I have nothing to contribute to this conversation, so that's why I'm not saying anything. I don't know dick about shit. Extreme question. Uh three inches. Oh. Where did your name come from? Uh a common nickname for people with my first name and Gran Turismo 4. That's it. The most basic ass of fucking name origins ever. Four also refers to my uh, my below average penis. Oop. Nope. I have never played Ratchet and Clank in my life, so. No relation there. The, the Doom BFG, you know, big fucking gun. The 
fuck tank. I just realized how, like, spread out the GTs are. Holy shit, no one's fighting anybody. We are riding. Not racing. We are spread the fuck out. It's like I'm playing Gran Turismo. Kind of funny. It's like a, a much weirder Gran Turismo. Oh yeah, BFG literally stands for big fucking gun. Like, even in the original Doom, that was its actual name. It is a big fucking gun. Oh yeah, I forgot. I always forget that the Doom movie starring Dwayne the Rock Johnson exists. Oh, there's a uh, there's gravel there. That's right, there was a weird, like, first-person sequence in the Doom movie. I've never actually watched the movie. Just know that it exists. Head shit. Quick bathroom break. It's fine. I love how goofy the PS2 is, by the way, like, the wheel only works, uh, it might even be on a per game basis, but, like, the steering wheel only works if you have it plugged into a specific USB port. Technology. Oh, leader's behind me. I saw that Bentley. I'm gonna guess that's Hussein. I'm, I'm guessing the roster is the same as the last career. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, he wouldn't. Okay. Yep. Yep. Geesh. So, yeah, this race is scheduled for 25 laps. I just went two down to the leader, so we got 14 to go now. At least the laps remaining counter actually like updates depending on how much you get lapped by the other classes. That's a neat little touch. Tell you what, it looks like we're going to have a lot more spread out racing in this career versus the uh, the first one. This might be a very anticlimactic end to this into this let's play. By end, I mean next like 20 hours. Extreme. Oh, here's the, I hear the Panos LMP. Oh, I see the Panos LMP. Goodbye. Oh shit, it actually uh, gives you a message when someone pits. That's cute. So Gibbs in the dome just went to the pits and actually told me that right before I set a purple. 
Pit in Hasegawa, BMW Pro. All right, so the dome and the BMW prototypes are already out of fuel. They're pitting at almost halfway. Very, it's got the spirit of America. Literally. Spirit of America stamped on its ass. I'm actually kind of sad that I'm not going to be able to drive the Panos in this extreme career since I won. I drove it in the uh, the, the Legend career. Uh, no tires, but there is uh, fuel consumption. That's what that extra gauge is for. Right below, to the left of the tack. Got more cars pitting. Seems this Audi is very fuel efficient. Hasn't even used a quarter of the tank yet. After almost 11 laps. <laughs> yeah. It actually has anti lag turbo on it. <laughs> you just don't get the funny pop sound. Oh my! Oh my God! Aggressive, dude. That guy. That guy's pissed, and he's coming. Whoever's in that Audi is not in a good mood. Oh, it tells when they're exiting the pits as well? Oh, okay. I, I guess I didn't see the pit out. I saw that the message, but I didn't read it. Anyways, uh, we're almost at halfway, at least for me. Halfway through the race overall. The leader has completed 13 laps. But I've only done 11. This entire, like, this entire difficulty mode is interesting. Just of... <laughs> The fact that they've added fuel in pit stops, like to only this. I don't know if uh, this also exists in single race mode, but because they do have the extreme difficulty in single race mode. God, the field is so spread out. Just all three classes, all 18 cars. Six second lead over Bonazza. God damn. If I remember correctly, I did win the endurance race here. Um, in the challenge mode by almost an entire lap. Yeah, at least we know why this game actually has like programming for pit lane for this one specific mode. Unlockable difficulty. I don't know. Probably because freaking, uh... There's like eight... There's like eight locations in this game and like 11 tracks across them all. I guess they didn't want to. They want, didn't want to make this too long, so they kept the number of races the same, but the length is just different. This is neat, though. Like, this is not exciting gameplay in any way. I'm not even gonna try to fake it, but this is interesting and neat that they added this to the game. I'm not going to say it's the most fun thing, but this was the PS2. We had Gran Turismo with 
that also had like two hour long races with six cars and nothing really happened outside of the first maybe two laps, so. I was with the wheel. I'm kind of getting used to it. Driving, driving pretty well. Still having some the occasional struggle with like understeer. Other than that, we're doing good. Driving good. Yeah, and then Gran Turismo 4 happened. They're like, what if 24 hour race, but only six cars will amount? Around a 13 mile track. And we ate that shit up. Myself included. Laps to go. Oh, Hussein's in the pits. From the lead. As is Baker in the Panos. Yeah, I mean, the Audi in general is a lot easier to drive than the Lister LMP. That's, that's a very low bar to clear. Oh, hi. Greetings, Dome. Greetings, Dome. And the Audis are coming in. So. Pit out, Hussein. Oh, that's, that's cute. So that's all the prototypes have made at least one stop so far. No one else has. My PS2 Fat has been through at least five, maybe six 24-hour endurances in GT4, all a spec I don't know how this thing's still kicking. I really don't. Right, have good sleep, Ludo. Thanks for hanging. Uh, yeah, the fuel gauge is the, is the tiny one. Oh, fuck. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah, I've heard many a tale of GT4 just breaking PS2 slims. Oh, we have our first uh, tin top car pitting. Freeze in the McLaren, I assume from the GTS lead. Yeah, the one that has been the, sa the same exact position since the start of the race. Apparently the Audi TT is very fuel efficient. And not only is the Noble slower in the straight line than any other car in this game, it's less fuel efficient in reality. We got a lot of GTS cars pitting this time. Hold up, do they disappear from the map whenever they pit? I'm just not paying enough attention. I 
I legitimately cannot tell. Oh, I've gained an overall position, by the way. I passed Banaza in the Centaur. I'm like, I'm like eagle-eyed on the map. I literally cannot tell. Oh, Quaif's in. Vaughn is in. Hi, Hussein. Alright, we're now three off the lead. It's very hard to tell because, like, there's also cars around them when they're entering and exiting, but I think they actually do get, like, removed from the map GT7 in sports style. Oh. Hey, look, it's my teammate. Oh yeah, there's Bond, just appearing. Uh, the Centura pitted, and that's when I passed him for position. I hear Panos. Six laps to go. I'm starting to think this Audi is just is not burning any fuel. Like that that gauge has not moved since the start. I have a fifty seven second lead. Allegedly. I think it's actually less than that. Apparently I have found the cheat car. Although the only GT car that has pitted so far is the Quave. Haven't seen the BMWs or the uh, the Noble in. My immersion. Oh God, test drive. My immersion. <laughs> Up test drive. Thanks for the resub. Hey, I'm playing this game with the wheel now for uh, complete immersion. So the TLDR, I'm doing the uh, extreme career now. Um, the extreme part is the races are five times longer. <laughs> At least this race is five times longer than on Legend difficulty. Also, there's a fuel gauge that has not moved. At all. We're good. It's, uh... About what do you expect from a 2002 PS2 game? I had to turn force feedback off, or else I feel like the internals of my uh, my G27 would just rattle apart. It takes a little getting used to once, because like how floaty the physics are. But once you like kind of train that like. You don't necessarily have to counter steer every little bit of oversteer, it's it's not bad. Like I'm driving the car pretty well. And I'm able to drive the car pretty well, so
Oh, is that the Noble? That's the Noble. About to lap the fifth place car. The, the most difficult part was trying to get my wheel to work because I forgot that the PS2 is weird. And um, you have to plug your wheel into a specific USB port for it to work. And then in the case of this game, it's the bottom port. I'm like, why is the wheel not working? I've even plugged it in first to make sure it's the first controller. Because like, it was plugged into the, the, the top USB port, not the bottom. Ho -ho. Oh my god. Audi times two. Boy, shit. And a couple wiggly boys. As I lap the noble. The wheel is a bottom. Just like me. Just like the wheel user. I wonder. Oh. The H pattern doesn't work. Sag. It'd be like that sometimes. Yeah, one of those Audi drivers is still just furious. Oh, the fuel cage moved. It moved. We, I finally used uh, a quarter tank. It took 18 and a half laps, but it finally happened. It does work. <laughs> By God. Holy shit. We did it. We've used fuel. We've consumed fuel. Good for so I can fuck it up so bad. Another prototype. Oh, yep, there's the BMW. Yeah. Only took almost the entire race to burn a quarter of a tank. Pissed. Dome Angie. Uh, you know we can we can take a look at the setup screen, Saturn. Do the next round. To dome somebody. <laughs> the game factors in fuel weight? I'm going to guess no. That would be huge if they, if they thought about that. Be very immersive if they thought about that. Alright, two to go. I'm actually surprised the Centaur hasn't caught me at all. Still 11th overall. Fuel damage. Oh, 
feel the immersion. Oh, bird's petting in the VMAC. Ooh, the wheel movement's almost like one to one. My wheel movement. There's a slight delay, but. Bert and Alouette. And a cope. And a. And her just endless supply of copium. Especially once that new Alira outfit gets revealed. Is the word. <laughs> real, uh, real Lord Mahavir for doing it in uh, vibes, Roberta. Gets into F2, gets outpaced by an F3 car. Oh, hey, we just got laps, so race over. You finished in first place. Yeah, we did it. Shout out to Donkey Lopsided. <laughs> Save our settings. Dad, <laughs> Dad, the Keenan, Keenan said that when referring to Div Kaloptar, so at one point I ran a 153 and I could not repeat that or even come close to repeating that. And P11, yeah. So, went in our class, did not get fast lap because Chung. Somehow, uh, simulated time, I guess. We won by a minute. That was a 40 minute race. Holy shit. Closek wins in GTS in the Lister. And then Hussein wins prototypes in the Bentley with Baker in the Pano second. But Panchal got the fast slap. Then overall, GTS has finished three laps behind. I finished four laps behind. I beat two of the GTS cars. Oops. <laughs> Very cool. So, there's the early points. Got three point lead over Chung. Close sec in front. And Hussein in front. And prototypes. So, that was just race one. <laughs> That was just the first race of the extreme career. We got four more in just this category. This is, ex yeah, pretty extreme. Total extreme racing. Or extreme immersion racing, there we go. We'll just, uh... Extreme. Uh, yeah, Saturn. The the goal is to win the championship in all three categories. Which, judging by this first race, I might be able to do it in the Audi. It's in the first season. Dominant win. Dude, my driving looks so much smoother with the wheel. Holy shit. Kind of incredible. Even on the replays, you can tell how much smoother I'm able to drive with the wheel versus the controller. Being able to actually turn a physical steering wheel versus clicking a thumbstick left and right. Amazing how technology works.
Even with uh, force feedback turned off, this actually feels it actually feels pretty good. So, hooray! Round one complete. On to round two. Oh, hey, that win in last race has put a smile on my face. Look at look how happy he is. He's like, yeah, we won. Thank you, Mr. Hyatt. All right, this one might not go as well because uh, Monza. <laughs> we'll see. I think a podium is on the cards. Depending on how, if I can overtake the Quaif through it pitting. But uh, I don't know if I'll be able to keep up with the BMWs. We'll see. Mr. Hyatt Regency. Also. Oh yeah, hey Caro. <laughs> Even still here. I finally finished that first race. Alright, I'm going to turn on practice to make sure the track conditions. Okay, we're dry. So, we're just not going to qualify. Fuck it. We got 25 laps to do here at Monza. That I don't need to do a 26th. Actually, it's probably going to be my 21. Uh, I finished in P1 uh, in class, P11 in overall. Off to Monza we go. Stop the cart. Oh. Understeer. Big understeer. Yeah, we got the chin chin din din. Chin chin. And PS2. PS2 is always having a time at that first chicane. At the start. I don't even use Winrar. I just use 7 zip. It's literally the same thing. Would you please give us money? Woo. Oh, that's a wall. Oh, 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 God. Oh, here we go. Well, if there ever was going to be a true test of how smoothly I can drive with a wheel, it's going to be Monza. I guess and Hockenheim. Whoop. Oh, that didn't work. All right, not a very good first lap here. I am still P last. A little bit of dead zone on the wheel, so I'm trying to like be careful with making small uh, steering adjustments. Still very wiggly on the brakes. Very understeery. In situations like that. Like, very understeery. Alright. What's up, Noble? Oh, okay, I'm just bullying him at this point. The goal is to pass the other car. What I'm doing is just kind of pushing McDowell along. Boy. Oh, apparently he's my rival. Okay. <laughs> Moving on. Also, I don't think I'm going to score a podium here. Because the, the top three are already way ahead. Sneak around 
my teammate, Matlub. Don't, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Yeah! Clean overtake, let's go. Another driver has just taken the 55 9 from Chung. Now you kind of come close to that. Not even a sub two minute. Here in Hockenheim is basically where I'm screwed. Where my chances of not winning the championship are like at their biggest. Just gotta do well at the win at the other three tracks, I guess. I don't know how Talheim's gonna go. I know I can definitely win at Springfield though. Springfield's like one of the easiest tracks to win at in this game. And Silverstone when it's dry. Yeah, probably Saturn. Because that's going to be the goal. Wiggly. Right, heavy braking is still pretty difficult with the wheel. It gets a little unsettled. Most likely. I think those are my only options uh, last time was either the Panos or the Zentora, so. Hello. What's up, Hussein? I love Sin. That why you're trans. <laughs> that was a joke. For legal reasons. It was a funny haha. -ha. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, take that, God. Satan is my daddy now. Let's see, try the VMAC again. <laughs> I still love, there was a time where uh, Rosemary the Wrestler, he would just wear a shirt that says Satan is my daddy. On TV. Very funny. Also, sort of in character because she's a demon. With seven different personalities that represent the seven deadly sins. It's spooky. I almost want to watch like the the Rosemary Demon like origin shit again because it's so cool, like how she kind of uh, transitioned her character into that in the in these. Yeah, I finally got a sub two minute lap. Transition 
Yeah. Not like that transition, but her character transition. Like, she went from normal McWrestler to literally, like, demon. Lucy. <laughs> Her name's Rosemary. Come on, Tank. Get with the program. Went from Courtney Rush, who was just a normal Mick human who came out to Bon Jovi, to, um. I think she used a fucking anime, like, opening team for a short time during, like,. The wacky shit. And then when she joined Impact, first time they gave her a freaking uh, uh, Marilyn Manson song. She was made by McDonald's. Yes. Just went faster, 58.26. We're scooting. Unfortunately, the only thing that's doing is just extending my gap on the cars behind me. Hey, the engine's in the back. We're no longer on hybrid power. Resident Evil. God, I'm now reminded of that one Doom, uh, Doom mod or whatever level pack that was based off of, like, the fuck was it? It was some sort of serial branding. I forget what it, exactly what serial. Check's Quest. Check's Quest. I just find that hilarious. <laughs> Oh shit, Roberta, that's awesome. I know she has like that big, uh, uh, what is it, Fire Pro Wrestling or whatever that game is, that like, that promotion that her and her boyfriend do. The seven foot four giant, Andrew Everett. Shout out. Legit, the reason why I'm still you know, I'm into wrestling today is because of her. My my stupid little little brain is like, holy fuck, this is this is this is actually really cool. This is fucking cool. This is cool. This is cool. I like this character. This character is awesome. Like, damn, this is what I've been missing. I thought they were dating it at some point. Unless I got my uh, wires crossed. Oh well, anyways, point is, they're cool. Fucking FMVs. Really, yeah. There's really nothing going on here. We didn't even have the uh, the, ex the the entertainment of the track itself. Okay, we're really just out here vibing, vibing in the the DTM car. In the Bosch car. Give them spark plugs. Tasty. Yeah, 
I think even if the quay pits for fuel, we'll probably still exit in front of me. Honestly, it looks sick. It looks like a fun platform for AI wrestling and shit. Too many original people. I've never actually watched any Dub 3, but like, I've seen tweets about it constantly. It looks awesome. Like, fire through. Five, 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 five. Can't speak. Right lead. That's sick. Okay. We're working on lap eight. I uh, got. I think the GTS car is approaching me. Or the prototypes again. I'm not sure which ones. Depends on how much time he loses in the pits. Oh, that's that's it. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. We're getting lapped by prototypes and GTSs. Oh god. Oh fuck. Oh man. Oh, it's all happening now. Yeah, we're going on an adventure. Going on a trip. I hear an animal has entered my room. It's, it's just, it's the other feline. Oops. A new venture, la la. I lost some time there. It's fine. Got myself out of the blender at least. Fucking, so the other cat is currently eating um, some of Clyde's food. And he's just laying here on the bed, flat fuck style. He'll be like, what are you doing? Come on. Flat f fuck Friday for me in like 20 minutes. <laughs> Number. I can only count to four. Don't know why a do is in my head, but do 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 do. BMW. Hey man, what time is it? It's quarter half past due. Oh, we have our first pit stop, Gibbs in the dome. He gets the worst fuel mileage. As does the BMW. So the two worst prototypes in the grid get the worst fuel mileage. It's pain. Sucks to suck, I guess. I actually see him in the pit lane. Oh, where am I going? It looks like they don't appear back on the map until they clear the uh, the ex like the blend line on the exit. At 
which here is like almost in the breaking zone for turn one. Everything. Honestly, Fire Pro sounds like a really fun just wrestling sandbox for creative types. Unfortunately, I'm not one of those people. Oh my god. There's a turn there, by the way. I just kind of forgot. BMW. <laughs> this turns shit. I thought this was a drag race. And a dry grace is a bathtub. Yeah. In MMA mode? Oh shit. Wiggling the ass. Whoa. Oh, bar land my death matches. Oh, God. John Moxley somewhere salivating at the thought. Five seconds behind Bond. And a podium not looking very likely. Even if I pass him on play from the pit stop. He'll probably still pass me before the end of the race. Dump speed. Ooh. Now I think there's somebody there's a unwanted intruder in here. Oh, wait, nope, never mind. I am going to pause to close my door, though. <laughs> Intruder alert! Dude, 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 oh, hey, look. Carl finally did the thing. Halfway through this race. Wow. Coming from the GTS is into the pits. Oh, oh, thank, oh, well. I've been bullied, oh, Jesus Christ. I'm still getting bullied. The 
the car as a whole makes 200 pounds of downforce. The fuck? That's not how that works. Not at all how that works. Yeah, the air completely stops. But the air goes only one way. And that is straight to the wing. Air never goes under a car. of the prototypes in the pits. Finishing fourth here. Oh, here we go, getting bullied by an Audi and Lesmos again. Go get him, Tiger. God, he just bolted past me. Oh, there's Bond in the pits. I, I'm immersed in driving the Audi. Just wish I was at a more interesting track right now. I hear Panos. Bond's already out of the pits. All right. So there's there's your confirmation. I'm definitely finishing fourth. I was able to pit for fuel and still exit in front of me. Oh well. I might have a better chance at Hockenheim because there's at least like two more turns there than here. But as far as Monza, definitely P4. Oh, don't. Monza. Oh, Jesus Christ. Push him off the track. Fuck him up. Oh, I beat me the last lap, I just realized. 57-9. We have something to talk about. Let me talk to you. Eight laps to go. Probably actually like seven. There's another car. The 
this the BMW? BMW. All right. some uh, swiping at the door. So I'm sure it was from the outside, not the inside. Um, I don't really know Saturn. There aren't really other any, like Japanese exclusive racing games I can think of that I know about that also don't have a translation. Because like the Q games have translations. Racing Lagoon does. Can't think of anything else. a little bit of a track cut. Hmm. I almost started like playing through the Chorky games. I'm like, no, I need to finish the series. I need to play through the games I already have, damn it. Stop adding more franchises. <laughs> You'll never finish any of them. just to play a video game. In order by complete accident. <laughs> Purchase, like, oh, this looks neat. Six to go, probably actually five to go. hearing noises. Okay, the noises are coming from outside my room. Okay, <laughs> I kept hearing like the puppy sniffing. I'm like, it sounds like she's in here, but like, it apparently isn't because I heard footsteps from outside. It was, it was really fucking with me, okay? I had to check on that. Thank you, me. Randy Orton. I'm 
the lads again. Thank you, race engineer, for explaining how racing works to me. That was a slow entry into Ascari. Lads, lads, lads. Ugh. The fellas, the boys, the dudes. Go. Oops, my old un unintentional cut. Got a game app? No, no, I don't. That fucking game exists. Actually, I I can. Off from bird. In and out quick. Oh, that's a wall, by the way. Oops. Oh yeah, that was a that was a thing. Imagine trusting people when they say that they're of legal age. Wait, really? The founder of Retro Studios, well then. Uh, you know, I don't know, Saturn. I haven't been paying attention. Since I just finished... Oh, hey. Uh, close to expiting. Considering I just finished lap 18, I'm guessing uh, it's been about a lap. Since uh, the gauge moved, all right, so all the GTSs are pitting again. It looks like at least the listers are, or the lister is. This is also. I was wondering if this game does like actually calculates like throttle time and uh rev like rev re, uh, b -b 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 yeah rev count into fuel consumption I don't think it does because I was about lap 18 at Silverstone is when I uh reached uh when, when the needle moved Jeez. It's goofy. Alright, 
Two to go. from the grass. Last lap. Uh, depending on who's behind me, it might be. Oh, the BMWs are pitting. Interesting. Maybe they do use a little bit more fuel in this track than Silverstone. Oh, no, it's just a McLaren. No. Looks like we've got one more lap. servers to host porn. Well then. Jeez. You're on your last lap. If I know that. What's up, Centura? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> God, yeah, fucking super horny old bros. I'm like, I know Nintendo owns some sort of porn IP. Super horny, yo, bros. my wife. Intense mama me. And with that, race two is complete. Oh well, better luck in your next race finished where I expected to finish, and not much else to say about that. It certainly was a race of all time. We'll see how that affects me in the, uh, in the points. Yeah, everyone else is just way too quiet, too, too fast, too quick, quast, what I was about to say. So Chung wins our class, DeFreeze wins GTS, and Hussein wins in prototypes. He actually did get around round at the end. So, getting quite spread out was everyone. Yeah, I don't know. Alright, so Chung takes the point lead. I'm only four behind him, so. If 
Depending on how I do with these next couple races, I might have a shot. I lost, how many points did I lose? I lost seven points. Okay. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I might need some uh, help from his BMW teammate or maybe the Quaif to uh, win this, but we'll see. Use some practice while you're learning. Not my fault, the car is objectively slower. Bitch. All right, well, race three, Springfield. This one will be an uh, easy dub, surely. So, let us head to Springfield. 21-ish laps. M.2 adapter for the GameCube, that's amazing. All right, go and practice, make sure the track is dry. Track is dry. And uh, let's race, I guess. 25 laps, Springfield, let's go. The duties. The race is on. The race is indeed on. On and 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 on. Oh, oh, eat hot, eat hot. I still use my game code Q. Which the GameCube kind of for me anymore is just like ah, if I want to play a GameCube game, I'll probably just enjoy it or something. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I only slightly died on the curbs. By the way, don't touch the curbs. Doesn't end well. Oh, that's a tighter turn. Uh. Alright, I'm trying to remember how the Springfield track goes. Alex! With the resub. Thank you, Alex. Appreciate it. Season. I don't know. We'll see how bored I get, I guess. Or how intense the title fight gets. Now, Lee's gonna do this in Talheim. Not the best lap one, considering I went off a couple times. But it's okay, we got 20 more to uh, get good. Staying away from the curbs. Curb scaly. is leading right now. Chung is the second of the BMWs, which would help me out immensely. If he finished third instead of second. That would just give me no room at all. Oh, I forgot to turn this on. Forgot to turn on the driver emotions. Ooh. 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 Big slide. Big grass. Gone better. Some big dive in Blackwood, that didn't work. I mean, I completed the pass, but I thought I would make maybe a cleaner dive. Unfortunately, clean racing is very difficult to do in this game. You've 
set the pace with the fastest lap of the race. Alright, I did. Now let's take the lead. Oh my god, huge slide. Oh, he's still wiggling. Oh, hi, how you doing? Alright, taking the top spot. Oh, we just gotta hold it here. Maybe pass a couple GTS cars along the way. Oh, shit. A little wide. It's fine. Ooh. Oh, man. This paint is all over the place. Uh oh. Too fast. Shit. Fucking it. Banking. Is yours. If Yay. Already you right, you got a five second lead over Bond. Looks like the BMWs have spread out. Hopefully, uh, Blackwood's ahead of Chung. Hopefully. Chassis on PZR. Yeah, they're fucking quick. Zoom. Zoomy. Now we just need to do a multi-class line rock race. What could possibly go wrong? Can't believe they actually did that. Who am I kidding? Yes, I can. Oh, hi Panos. How we doing? Multi-class at high speed are going to be pretty cool, actually. That track's wide enough. Twelfth overall. We are past one of the GTS cars. Hmm. Oh, dicks. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. Yeah, that's how not to do that chicane. You've been lapped. Hi, Hussein. The race will now be a lap shorter. Here come the prototypes. See, I mentioned multi-class multi at Lime Rock because it's that actually happened in real life. Unironically. Out to the American Le Mans series. How'd it go? Uh. That was a lot of clinching. Luckily, it was during the time in American Le Mans where there was only like three prototypes in the entire field. But, oh, Jesus Christ. Like, there were, like, two LMP1 cars, and then the Penske Porsche LMP2 cars, which were as fast as LMP1 cars. And that 
that's about it. Maybe a couple other P2s. Hi, very pissed off Audi. Whoa! I lived? T sort of? Jesus Christ. I believe I almost got murdered by a fellow Audi driver. Yeah. Going for the uh, reverse entry into turn one. the Centura spun around. So no one will see that I'm gay. What? Also does that. I think they still do that. Chicane. Honestly, the thing I like about I remember most about Laguna Seca is watching the old uh, Monterey historic races. Just an entire weekend of historic car racing. It's dope as shit. Just seeing a bunch of like old ass, goofy looking cars. behind me. It wasn't burden in VMAC or am I dumb? Oh, as long as it's not a uh, not Chung in second. With the fastest lap time, you could be in for an extra point. Jump for the worst track to do multi-class. Uh Probably Monaco. Either Monaco or Macau. Or Poe or just any of those weird ass, tight ass street circuits. Macau with this hairpin we're overtaking is actually illegal. Uh, Baku would be sketchy, but I think possible. It's got enough long straightaways. probably have to like ban overtaking in the castle section but other than that
it's, it's interesting. Not the biggest fan of it, but the last couple sectors are fun in fast cars. I was going to ask, I wonder if European Le Mans goes to RBR. Mm, mistake sauce ring. Seconds ahead of Bird now. We are winning this race. That is for damn sure. You set the pace with the fastest lap of the race. Hell yeah. PB by half a second. those two GTS cars behind me. Including the Centura that spun out earlier. Oh, dicks. Alright, not the best run through that chicane, but it works. Hussein. Bye, Hussein. Look at all the frickin' tire marks. Just every turn. LMP. It is way up to second. You've got the fastest lap of the oh. race so far. Alright, I just tied my PB. Funny. Once again, for the most part, feel pretty spread out now in terms of racing for position. Paul Ricard puts a layout changes every lap. It's like the uh, the live routes or whatever it was called from Grid 2. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Lap of the race. Almost in the 140s. Split 
second super power play. <laughs> Car bicycle, get loose. Oh, okay. We're just gonna understeer off the track, don't mind me. There is an Asian Le Mans series. Hey, look, it's my teammate. About to go a lap down. In class. Oh, oh god, oh god. Three outies, oh no. Three outies walking to a bar. <laughs> That's it, well then. Excuse you, Dome. Oh, he's coming in. Hi, other Audi. Dude, just pass me, bro. You gotta bully me like this. Bro. You're not even mad. What are you doing? Oh, and then he's gonna stop. Alright. He's gonna brake check me like an asshole. Alright, I just, uh, I just dive bombed an Audi prototype in an Audi <laughs> DTM car. Interesting. <laughs> That would imply people would watch this far. Australia. It's just completely straight. It's actually a drag strip. One of your rivals is straight ahead. Yeah, and I'm about to lap him. I guess I have a rivalry with this noble driver. Not in the best of moods. Thirty-five corners, that's quite a few bins. Oh, I keep forgetting about that. Uh, the the fuel thing. Completely forgot. This might be my last race of the night because I'm kind of feeling tired. Makes enough sense. We'll go with that. All right, about eight laps to go. Oh, 
Hi, BMW. Don't want to think, yeah. Very slow going through the chicane. Okay, in game track is this. Uh, Springfield. Fictional racing circuit. At least time stamping this on YouTube be easy. Race one, race two, race three. There you go. Or is it Saturn? Da 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 Honestly, this track isn't that bad. Just a theory. Excuse me. Sneeze. Oh, wow, 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 Everything is still fine. Holy shit, that was actually a pretty good line there. That was not on purpose. That was kind of sick. Moving on. Am I about to lap one of the BMWs? Am I about to lap my championship rival? And then he's heading straight into the pits. The lap is yours. Yeah, I just ran a 39. We finally got a sub 140. Oh. Here we are lapping. I think that's Chung. Yeah, I was on pace for a 40. I don't know if, like, I gained a lot of time from getting hit. Or, no. I didn't get hit from behind. I don't know, either I just went really, really quickly through that final sector, or I got some sort of, like, slipstream or something. Or some sort of boost. Either way, 39. Yeah. Necessary upshift. One point seven back. This sector split. Seven tenths in that final sector. Yeah, I don't know. 
It's the Quaif. I'm in P3. He's now gone minus a lap to the class leader. I just realized I gained, a, I gained a spot through the GTS pit stops. I'm in the overall top 10. Hey, yo. There's an official Jordan GP PS1. What? It's, it's, it's when? Oh, Hussein's back. Huh. Did I learn? That's cool. Oh, Panos. Panos, please. Well, we're we're still we're still a shit. Wait a minute. Is that one of the McLarens? Did I somehow pass one of the McLarens through pits? I think that's what happened. Huh. Well then. That is absolutely what happened. Those damn Americans. That's de he was definitely channeling the spirit of America there. Man, the AI fucking suck at this track. I'm literally about to pass the... The, the fastest GTS car for position. The scenes. Also, the, uh, the AI timing's all fucked up. Said bird was eight seconds behind me. I know that's false. Bonds in pits. Relinquish P3. Also, I think. Yeah, because this track is shorter. Oh, fuck me. That was a bad bounce. So, because this track's shorter, still haven't used a quarter of my tank yet. We <laughs> get demoted back to cars. What if it's. I wonder if that's Ragunathan in that Camar uh, Camaro. Wow. McLaren. Lord Mahavir. Bimak, no. Oh. No, I'm ahead of uh, the Panos, the Satura, and one of the McLarens. He's like right on my ass, too. Try to fumble this bag. Here it comes. 
Audi. Angry Audi. Timing's all fucked up. Same bird's only 10 seconds behind me now. It's definitely not true. How you doing? In fact, he's right in front of me. <laughs> Got an overall top 10 in this? Okay. Damn. I think I've just lapped the field, the GT field, despite what the game is telling me. Why well, conserve fuel when I can, when I don't need to? He barely uses any. Flat out, brother. Final lap. Here's the final lap of the race. Okay, nine seconds, air quotes. Still pretty sure Bird's like in the V-neck. I don't I don't know what's happening here. Hi, hi BMW, how you doing? Actually, speaking of VMAC, there it is. Right in front of me. Going very slowly. Like, very slowly, what? I don't know why the VMAX. Why are the GTS cars going so slow all of a sudden? I just took ninth overall. <laughs> This is an interesting race. Oh, 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 save it. He saved it. Okay, there we go. We've got a shit to go now. Alright, well we had a uh, we had a sniff of P9. Uh, we're going to finish P10 overall, which is still great. And we're going to get the big one-lap dub in class. Great racing. There we go. You're the winner. You're the winner. Time for clan. 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 I can't speak. Clones of my here. <laughs> All right, we did twenty-two laps this time. We only got lapped three times by the uh, prototypes. Cool. So there it is. Oh, Chung ended up second. Damn. Yeah, I don't know why I was showing Bird. Got to Bird because he's in the freaking VMAC. Who I was racing for overall position. Oh, timing got all kinds of fucked up. So Chung finishes second, Blackwood third. I was really hoping Blackwood would uh, beat him, but that did not happen, unfortunately. Oh well, still plus five points though. Uh, close sec wins in GTS over DeFreeze. And then Hussein wins overall in the Bentley with the fast lap. Pano's in second again. Very good, very good.
So three laps to G. There we, there it is. Top ten overall. I beat three GTS cars. Oh God, I did. I, my my PB was faster than both Bonazza and Arnie's and Bird. That's hilarious. Incredible. That certainly was a a race of all time. Well, we got the points lead back. One over Chung. With two races remaining. One that I definitely will not win, and another that I have a maybe pretty good chance at winning. And I'm hoping I can maybe at least get a podium at Hockenheim. Our knees back to the soapbox. And that, they did the Pano's uh, Esperante dirty in this game. It's so slow compared to all the other GTS cars when an AI drives them. Got a tie for the GTS point lead. And then Hussein's running away with the prototypes just like he did in the last career. So that was Springfield. So we got two races to go. However, because I'm feeling a little bit it's kind of meh right now. Put a smile on my face. Wow. Might be able to grab that title proper noun. Okay. Stay sharp. Keep the heat on. I will fucking try, my dude. But yeah. Um, we will save the final two rounds for next time. Oh, I don't have enough memory card space. Okay, I'll just overwrite the old career. It's fine. And then next time on Total Immersion Racing, we'll finish our first season of the Extreme Career. And probably move on to Season 2. Hopefully, I'll win the GT Championship in my first try. I don't know. We'll see.